All right, this is going to be a quick video on the teleportation system inside of the zombie survival template. So this is a blank project in here yet. So the first thing you do is right click, make a new folder, and I call mine teleporter. Then right click, create a blueprint class, an actor, and I call this BP teleport one. Double click it. Then I'm going to add in a plane. I'm going to add in a box collider. Or sorry, a box trigger maybe? Box trigger? Box collision. Box collision. I'll move that up. And I'll scale the plane down to match it. All right, then I'm going to compile save. I'm going to go to the event graph and delete all this saved. Then I'm going to click on the box collider, right click, add events for box, collision, uncomponent begin overlap. Then I'm going to cast to third person character. There, other actor. Then I'm going to spawn actor from class. Then I'm going to select BP teleport. I'm going to use without effects. So I'm just going to show you again which one I used. I use this one here. If you have the material set up for the effects you can use the teleportation here but I'm just going to use this all right then spawn transform split structure connect third person character to target then compile and save then you go back in your scene drag in the teleporter here and then you're going to go to window place actors and then I'm going to put an empty actor over here. You can use a plane, but I like to use an empty actor. And pick it up a little bit. And then you'll see the location right here. This is what we're looking for for the destination. So we'll open our teleport blueprint back up. And I'm just going to minimize it so I can see both. So we got our empty actor. This is going to be the destination of where we teleport to. So our destination is going to be negative 530, negative 530, negative 160, and 250. File, save, and then I'm going to test this out. So I stand here, play a little particle, and port me over here. And then if you want to have another room that takes you back to here, all you have to do is go to your teleporter, select it, control W. This will be like your, your second teleporter. So we'll pretend I'm in a different room. So this is another teleporter. And maybe we want to go back to uh, the original position over here. So we'll open up this. We teleport one, two, we should have two. Teleport two. Then we're going to get another empty actor. And we'll put this over here. This will take us back to our original position. So inside of our new blueprint, this will be in your second room. We'll go down to our destination and we'll take the destination for the new room. So which is going to be negative 680, 680, and 180. So for example, start the game. Then we hit the first teleporter, 
takes us to the first room. Go through the room. And we want this teleporter to take us back to the original position. And we're back to the original position. That's all there is to it. Have a great day.